was seven years old when my parents told me that I have Williams Syndrome. It didn't mean much to me at the time, other than the fact that I was happy to have something that my sister didn't have. <laughs> I felt like a pretty normal, happy kid, but when I got into fourth and fifth grade, things started to get harder. I was really struggling to understand the concepts, and with 32 kids in the classroom, my teacher couldn't help me as much as I needed. Now, let me tell you about people with Williams Syndrome. We are very social. So, instead of trying to get help, I would just bounce around my Montessori classroom, checking in on what everybody else was doing. But I was not learning. There were so many kids. My voice m felt small. Math was hard and I didn't feel like I could ask for help. I felt like my emotions started to control me. When I came to Groves in sixth grade, I didn't know what to expect, but it has turned out to be so much more than I could have ever hoped for. I don't feel rushed all the time. I get enough time to get my work done. I always get the help that I need. I've learned so many skills that have helped me become a better student and a better person. Like how to advocate for myself, how to better control my emotions, and how it is okay to make mistakes and try again. I've learned about accommodations and how that can make a person thrive, like me with math. Oftentimes, I know the answer. It just takes me longer. At Groves, I am a mentor for younger students. I've learned how being of service to others can bring joy to myself. It makes me feel like I have a nice bright light filled with confetti. <laughs> I have a sweet sensation to do more giving. Overall, I feel relieved at Groves. I finally have a voice that I can use. I can share my feelings. My opinions are heard, and I am more confident that I can learn. Groves is a very special place. They taught me that I can do anything with a growth mindset. Growth mindsets are amazing, okay? We all need them in our lives. And um, I strive to be a strong role model and advocate for people with disabilities. I dream of attending college and getting a degree in musical theater or music therapy. Throughout history, people with disabilities haven't had the opportunity to have a good ed education. They would mostly be separated from their peers because they are different. But in reality, they can do so many things. They need supports and encouragement, skilled teachers. They just need a chance. And, as a person with a disability, I'm grateful to have this chance at Groves. My hope for the future is that more students can attend a school like this, where all students can thrive, feel safe, and find success regardless of their learning difference. Groves Academy has made this possible for me. Thank you.